Hello! One of the main benefits of UiPath Cloud Platform is the possibility to collaborate with your peers on your automation processes. It's easy to enable your colleagues to jump in at any moment to help scale up the automation initiative. To bring them on board, you have to invite them first. To do so, go to the Users tab and click Invite Users. Here you can add as many as you need. Just fill in their details and click Invite. Invitations are automatically sent out to each of the provided email addresses with a link to your UiPath Cloud Platform account. By accessing the indicated link, your colleagues can sign up as a user within your account. By default, the invited colleague has a user role within your account. You can change the role at any point, granting your colleague administrative permissions through the account administrator role. Now, there are three different roles available for the users at account level. The first one, the account owner, is the person who initially signed up for the UiPath Cloud platform account. This role grants permissions to every account or service level feature. There can be only one account owner. The account owner cannot be changed and the user with this role cannot be deleted. Another role is the account admin, which grants access to all account level features. A user with this role can perform all administrative actions, such as creating or updating services, requesting or renewing licenses, managing users, viewing audit logs, and so on. You can have more than one user with the account admin role. And last but not least, the user role is the default role assigned for anybody invited to join your account. Unless edited by someone with account owner or account admin roles, a person who accepts the invitation and signs up to an existing account has access to a limited number of functionalities, such as dashboard, resource center, or services, with view-only permissions. Assign the desired role for the user by selecting one of the available options, user or admin, and click Save. To remove a person's access to your UiPath Cloud Platform account, just delete their user. You can do this by clicking the Delete button next to a user, or by selecting multiple users and removing all of them in one sitting. The user management activities previously performed at orchestrator level are now available at service level within your UiPath Cloud Platform account. To manage user access and permissions for a specific service, Head to the Services tab and click Manage Service. You can add users with specific roles to a service, change the role of a user within the selected service, or remove the access of users from that service. Roles are specific for every service, and you can view them directly within that service's roles page. In your orchestrator instance, go to Users and open the Roles tab. There is only one default role available for the users at service level, and that is the administrator role. To create custom roles, just click the Add button. Type a name for the role, select the desired rights, and click Create. These roles should be immediately available to assign to users from your Cloud Platform account. To grant access to a service from your Cloud Platform account, open the Services page and in the Users tab, click Add Users. Select a user from the available users list on the left and they are moved to the selected users list on the right. Select one of the roles defined for that service and click Add. To change a user's role within a service, just edit the user, select the desired roles and click Save. Removing a user's access to a service is very easy. Just click the Remove button next to their name and confirm the action. And that's it. Now you know how to invite your colleagues to UiPath Cloud Platform and how to manage their privileges. Thanks for watching.